Hi, my name's Sky. Um, thought I'd share with you today what I've been thinking about, kind of what God's been going on. You know, but you know what? Man, my lately, I just it's like when I come to God in the mornings or even at night, like there's like this burning in my heart. I mean, it's it's really a burning, and I, I really don't know what it is. I, I really don't know. It's like this this, this pain kind of right here, but it's not. It's it, it is a physical pain. It's a it's a want or a, a desire for for something, for something. It's like it's like a God kind of a God. It's like God put it there because when I talk to Him, it just gets more. It just gets greater. It just gets stronger. A desire for Him. desire for Christ. When I look through the, the Minor Prophets, which is what I've been I'm doing a lot of lately, and it talks about um, wanting more of God, asking for more of God, getting more of God. And actually in Isaiah, I think it's, uh, this is a major prophets, but um, Isaiah 62, verse 6, it says, I have posted watchmen on your walls, O Jerusalem. They will never be silent, day or night. You who call on the Lord, give yourselves no rest. And give Him no rest till He establishes Jerusalem. It's almost like in this in this place, as, as God's talking to His people about what Jerusalem's going to be like and, and the future, He's asking His people to call out to Him. He says, you who call on the Lord, give yourselves no rest. I mean, that's a measure of devotion to want that. And man, when I read that, it makes me want. It makes me want God more than more than anything else. More than in this case, yeah, more than sleep. Give yourselves no rest. You who call on the Lord, man. If I'm one who calls on the Lord, God's saying, Sky, give yourself no rest. Call on me, and I will answer you. And give him no rest till he establishes Jerusalem. You know who him is? Him is God. Give God no rest. Continue crying out to him from the depths of our soul, from our heart, for what we want, which is hopefully what he wants, because he wants to meet those desires and yearnings and longings in our heart. And so you know what? That's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to call out to God. And I'm going to give him no rest. You who call on the Lord... Give yourselves no rest. If I consider myself one who calls on the Lord, I'm going to do that today fervently, excitedly, with expectancy. Because He asked me to today, and He wants me to. That's what I'm going to do today.